Hi everyone, in today's tutorial we'll be talking about Google Forms sections. All right, let's go ahead and get started. I've created a simple questionnaire already and you can see it uh, displayed here. Uh, in it, uh, I have a total of five different sections. All right, uh, the first section basically just gives instructions that I want my uh, participants to read and then from there we go into specific questions all right now how you create a section is actually very simple and I've found that if you've uh, already created sections and want to add another new section maybe you want it to appear uh, at the very end of your survey uh, the way to do that is to just click inside the last item that you've created in your form and then click the add section option alright so again click in your last content area that you've created and then choose to add a new section here we are alright and you can give it a title now in order to get rid of a section you're gonna click the dot menu here on the section and notice the options duplicate move delete or merge with the above all right, I just want to delete this, so I will choose that option there, and it's and it's gone. All right. Now you'll notice in these sections, you can see the question that I've attached to it. Uh, we're able to actually see the answer choices if we expand our section, and the way we do that is to look for this little icon right here. This will expand or collapse the content of a given section. So notice what will happen if I click there. You can see our answer choices for that particular question. All right, again, I can collapse this section content and we don't see it. All right, same thing with my third section. I want to expand it so I can see all the content inside this section. There it is, all right? It might seem a little confusing at first. I would assume, just because of the way this button is designed, that this would actually allow you to move the section up or down. Uh, it doesn't. All right, so just just you have to remember that uh, to move a section. Let's say this last one here, breakfast. Well, it appears at the very end of my questionnaire, and I want that to go at the top. How we move that up is to just click on the dot menu and then we'll select merge with above Oop, nope don't want to do that click undo so you do have a level of undo wanted you all to be aware of that alright so let's choose the right option this time click the three dot menu and we're gonna say move section alright so it's gonna list all of our sections here and so breakfast we want to move that right above lunch there we go and we'll save it okay now we're set okay so in section two you can see that I'm asking them what their favorite meal of the day is now based on their selection I want them to be taken to a specific section here's how we achieve that All right, I'll click on the question in the lower right hand corner you'll see three dots choose that and then select go to section based on answer alright so if they choose breakfast we want to continue to section three alright if they chose lunch we'll go to section four if they chose dinner we'll choose section 5 as for these other uh, sections uh, we don't want them to go then to the lunch questions after they have finished breakfast we want them to just be finished uh, with this survey so where it says after section 3 what we want to have happen we will say submit the form all right we'll do the same thing for section 4 submit the form and the same thing for section five you'll notice that's not an option there because when you're at the end uh, of the form 
it automatically puts the submit button there for you. You don't have to uh, tell it to do so. All right, so this is looking uh, the way I think we need it to. All right, so at this point, let's preview it and see how this is all going to work. All right, so I'll click on my preview button here. All right, you can see this is actually section one where it gives a description or instructions, whatever you want to put in there. We'll click next. All right, what is your favorite meal of the day? I'm going to say dinner. All right, so I'll choose that. And then when I click next, uh, you see it takes me to the dinner question. All right, and I'll say tacos. And then submit. And it's done. All right, let's see once more how this works. I'll go to submit another form. It takes me to the very beginning. Next, let's say my favorite meal now is breakfast. I'll choose that. Next, all right, what is your favorite main dish? Oh, I'll say pancakes. Submit, and we're done. Thanks for watching today's tip. If you have any questions, feel free to email me. And if you like videos like this, be sure to subscribe.